Hey everybody, welcome back to more Early Mutations. I'm Andre FI and we are taking care of week 92. Can you believe it? It just keeps getting further and further. Anyways, um, we are doing Wheel of Misfortune on Lock and Load. So, let's see, we got Speed Freaks, Double Edged, and Self Destruction right now. Um, Double Edged might be a little bit of an issue for me, but not too bad. I think it's going to go away. Yeah, it's going to go away pretty quick. So I don't really have too much to worry about as of right now. I'm just going to simply follow my normal build order, 9 gas, 11 pool, and then just the rest of my tech. That's really about it. Um, sorry, 12 pool. I'm doing a 12 pool, y'all. Anyways, um, CTG is going to be a level, I don't know, 110 Abathur. Anyways, so he specifically chose the top one so that he could lay biomass. I'm going to move this guy a little bit over here so that he has access to stuff over there if he needs it. Get this. Get an overlord. And then make sure I saturate my gas. Anyways, not really too much to worry about right now. Like I said, just gonna make sure I get my bailing nest out and just work from there. Get two sets of lings. So we can start taking care of the rocks. Just get some more drones. Get some gas. Spawning pool. Oh, sorry, evolution chamber. So we're working on my upgrades. Not really too much. Like I said, most things are going to happen a little later. He's already cleared out most of that, so I don't need to worry about that. I can pretty much just go right over there and right over here, so. Alright, so let's move a drone over here. Let's grab you guys, put them there. Really just focusing on getting my economy up as fast as I can. Are just going to go straight out here. Again, I still wish that they would figure out a way to make it so you didn't have to rebind the hotkeys for Zagaras when she comes out, but you know, what are we going to do? Zagara should be out real soon. I'm just going to hang out here. Wait for that. Allies are engaged in battle. Let's get that. Your grotesque Zerg have me. Should we get done? We should get done with this pretty quick, to be honest. Yeah, what the heck is going on? There we go. We must join our allies to claim the objective. The swarm hungers. All right, let's get that. Let's get this. We need one more over here, and the rest of my overlords. Sharing the Zerg regeneration, healing in progress. There it is. Oh, can't get through that way. Okay. We have activated a celestial lock. It would be wise to defend it as we work to secure the others. Look at that. Just working on upgrades. Are ready to what are your commands? 
got all of our tech up. We just got to finish getting the rest of it. And I made sure to have the overlords there just to help my partner out. So I wanted to make sure that he could do that if he needed it. Transactions. We must secure the remaining two. Alright, so I'm just going to focus on getting as much upgrades as I can right now, just because the we have microtransactions happening right now, and if I can just... Ah, I wish microtransactions would go away, but that's alright. Gonna start rallying everything to Zagara. Just try to micro just Zagara. Alright, let's get make some more drones. Alright, make some more Zerglings. Make sure everything rallies to Zagara. I guess this one should not take very long. Like I said, not too much left to do here. Microtransaction is making this rather annoying, but you know what? We gotta do what we gotta do, right? Oh my god, propagators? Oh jeez. You have destroyed the construct. Amon can no longer use it against us. Results unsurprising. Swarm efficient. Ruthless. Amon's forces are moving upon the celestial lock. If they gain control of it, the lock will begin to overlap. I just want to get right over here. We'll secure control. Who has encountered the enemy? Evolution All right. complete. That should be good. Alright, <laughs> as soon as Propagator showed up, like, let's just finish the mission. Just finish the mission. We did it! So, this is something very important for anybody who has an Abathur partner. You 
really want to help them get their toxic tests. You might give them more kills, you might do a lot of different things, but I tell you, they will really appreciate helping them out with toxiness. That's why I was constantly moving overlords into position to help my partner out, because it really, it helped. It made it so much easier. Now, he took care of the first set and the second set, which was the, normally what would be the first lock and then the second lock. I took care of the third, the ramp, a whole bunch of different areas just so he could set up, get ready to go, get his ultimate evolutions, and then just move on. Super quick mutation this week, as long as you're helping each other out and you don't get completely wrecked by the um, or original three mutators. Anyways, I'm Hunter Rayfi. Make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. I do hope you enjoyed.